Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. You're welcome to Tuesday, the second day of August 2022. Our topic today is service, a key to insight. The Bible says the secret of the Lord is with them that fear him and he will show them his covenant. Psalm 25 verse 14. Thought for the day. One key to insight is service. Service brings insight. Insight or revelation is crucial to life and destiny fulfillment. Those who have insight make impact in life. Insight is a key to flight. Now, one key to insight is service. Service brings insight. To fear God means to reverentially worship and serve Him. And the secrets or the insights of the Lord are with those who fear and reverence and run his errands or serve him. Psalm 25 verse 14. God shows his covenant to his servants. For example, in the days of Daniel, no one served God like Daniel. Even when there was a decree that nobody should pray, Daniel prayed until he was cast into the lion's den. The king knew Daniel as a servant of the Most High God. Everyone in Babylon knew that Daniel was dedicated to the service of God. You see that in Daniel 6.20. Beloved, the question is, in your office or in your family or in the place where you reside, what do people know of you regarding service to God? What are you known for? Now, in the generation of Daniel, no one had more revelation than him. No one had the revelation of the word of God and the revelation of the spirit of God like Daniel. So if you will serve God like Daniel served, you will connect high frequency insight from God. If you see a person who is lost in soul winning, distributing tracts here and there, fasting, praying, serving in the house of God and saturating the neighborhood with the glory of God through cell fellowships, that person is a candidate for abundant light and insight from scriptures. Remember this, that one key to insight is service. Service to God will bring insight from God. Praise God. What's our assignment today? First and foremost, refuse to be a nominal Christian. Be dedicated to God in service. Number two, make the service of God like soul winning. Make the service of God such as soul winning, assignments, uh, working in the house of God, home church assignments, and so on and so forth, top priority of your life. And you'll be surprised at how far God will take you in life. Let's pray. Say after me, thank you, Lord, for your word to me today. I receive the grace to serve you passionately and dedicatedly. Oh, Lord, in Jesus' name, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I decree and I declare today access to light. Bright light is your portion in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'd like to pray for you. It's your birthday today. I wish you a very happy birthday. As your days are, so shall your strength be. God cause his face to shine on you and be gracious unto you in Jesus' name. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. And by all means, I pray for you, your birthday this year shall be the very best ever. Increase on every side, multiply it, have it. Supplies, provision be made available to you in Jesus' name. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Peace.